So I just filmed, I just touched up my makeup. I've had this on since 7.30 this morning. Remember I went and took my picture? It turned out, okay, but beside, that's totally beside the point, but I'm very happy with my picture. That being said, I touched up with this, which is something that I do. So the thing is, is I do so many makeup looks a day, I don't normally touch up. But when I do, and I filmed a video on this, I use the Janessa Myricks Blurring Balm. The reason why is because I just feel that when you add really dry powder on top of really uh, dewy skin, I don't wanna say oily, that sounds disrespectful, just extra dewy skin, it goes <laughs> really fast. There's no other way to describe it. You might be tuning out because you're like, ugh, Rose, she's so annoying. But that's the best way that I can describe that. Um, so by applying this blurring balm powder on top, it kind of just takes it, it takes on the skin, it goes, Okay, here I am. I told y'all I'd be here. Just a reminder. You see that? Biggest sale of the year. This is a big one. Some might say a doozy. 25% <laughs> off. Cyber 25. I'm going to get y'all a link. And then we're going to talk about things that I have enjoyed recently and things that didn't work for me. It kind of, I'm trying to think of the right words. It adjusts. It acclimates acclimates to the skin and it and it dries down and that's where you get this more set look but at first it goes on and it's like oh I can handle this it's very similar to the texture that I have on my skin right now as opposed to just putting on a pressed powder and then going right in and sometimes that just causes more chaos so I did film that but I want y'all to know about it first and the reason I don't really talk about touching up a lot is because to tell you the truth I filmed so many videos in one day that I normally don't, I don't touch up. I'm just going to makeup town. I'm just reset, reset. Let's go on to the next look. But yeah, you'll see in that video. And of course I explained it here. And if you want to know what my lip is, I have on Mario lip liner in the shade Jeff. I love this shade. In fact, I was going to shade a little bit more. And then the gloss is this J cap beauty. The Lip Tonics, what shade is this? Gamma Ray, it's so pretty. And then I'm actually going to take this shade three because it does have a little bit more pigment in it. That's actually, not there we go. Shade three, and then I'm just going to kind of create a barrier and clean up. This bomb to powder situation is gonna create a barrier. So if you ever have feathering or if you have lines around your lips, Something like this is really gonna help clean up and stop feathering. So things that I did not enjoy this week, we talked about this, but I wanna give you another option. Um, I thought about it, but it wasn't the day that I talk about things, so it's okay. So this ordinary pink serum that is going viral on TikTok, this one, the moment I show it to you, you're, you're gonna recognize it. I feel that it just balled up on my skin. I have tried it long enough to try it in different ways. I am not the kind of person that tries something once and then doesn't try it anymore. But this is just not one for me. Now, if we want barrier support and barrier repair, let me get you a link and a screenshot. This, this stuff, so nice. Just absolutely heals my skin barrier just stays on my skin, doesn't peel. I've used this for years. I believe it's $18 and they're having a Black Friday right now. Um, I, this has never let me down. And like I said, I've used it forever, forever. It is so good. That's all I can say. If my skin is going through it, I'm slathering this on. There's actually a very heavy cream too. Um, I like that one, but this one is enough for me and where my when my barrier gets aggravated but if you need even more there are different there's a, a much stronger one a different level i can't get over this i repurchased this this one's a 10 out of 10 for me and roughly the same price and if you're wondering bros it said 18 on the screen as i was recording this was absolutely blocking it it's the little uh recording button so don't think that i've completely checked out <laughs> And if you want to know what the sparkle is on my lid, which I highly recommend, it's this right here from LH Cosmetics. Look at that sparkle. These are stunning. Okay, now this one's gorgeous, and I just have it on top of matte shadow. It does. Yeah, I was able to kind of tap it out to where it doesn't have too much of a base, but it was like it's it was like 
who am I? It's just extremely shimmery and sparkly and so, so, so pretty. So it looks darker here, but you can sheer it out. And that's what I did on my lid. And then wait, wait, wait for it. Okay. We got to use this color on Feral Monday. I'm going to leave it out because, excuse me, what? It, what? We have to use that. Ooh, I'm excited. I feel so bad. I, um, <laughs> I left that in the middle of the screen. I panicked. So I live in a neighborhood and I heard kitty cats outside fighting. My cats are inside. I don't know why I panic. Um, had nothing to do with my cats. I don't even know where the cats are, but I'm breathing heavy now because I'm, I love my little critter so much. Like I said, I don't know why I'm freaking out. I know where my cats are. You just never know. So sorry about leaving that in the middle. I feel very bad. I'll swatch them again. <laughs> These animals. Oh. So it's, the text isn't in the middle. I'm so sorry. I mean, I'm pretty sure y'all would have done the same thing. And then this is the one that I have on my lid. Oh, dear Jean. Oh, so pretty. And remember, you can shear them out too. So y'all know that I've been wearing the Cover FX foundation. That's what I have on. I actually bought another shade. I need to wear just a little bit lighter. I bought, I bought L2. And then I bought this. I have not tried this in years, but this used to be the coverage it's called total cover and guys share the bed now the cat and the dog are going through it yeah that's gonna be a good shade this stuff is oh it almost disappeared i'm so excited so i'm ex i haven't tried this one in a long time i i know i remember loving it so i'm excited to use this next week and then like i said i bought the shade l2 i bought both of these by the way mob beauty Please, suspended sparkle bomb. They're having their Black Friday sale right now. And I really think that that's something that y'all might want to take advantage of. One of my favorite brands of all time, you know that we did this collab. Look at suspended sparkle bomb. For no reason. Well, for some reason. <laughs> it's so beautiful. Um, when I launched this, I knew that I had, I want, obviously I wanted to share it with all of y'all. So this is my official collab. But I don't want to just continue to just use the one thing and just be like this, this, this. But I'm excited. I'm going to leave this out and we're going to do some more looks with it next week. But right now, right now is the time to get it. Now, something that really surprised me was the Marilyn Monroe Wet n Wild collection. I'm not into a lot of collections. I'm not the one that's trying every single collection that normally comes out but this palette we did a look with it last friday it's a 10 out of a 10 would recommend if you can find this i'm thinking walmart walgreens cvs if you can find this add it to your cart so that's all it is it doesn't have a name it's just the wet and wild Marilyn monroe such good quality also the lip liner okay again no name it's just the Marilyn monroe wet and wild and then even the bullet lipstick i love a wet and wild lipstick they never let me down look at this color we did this this one's on youtube okay um, yeah this one's already on youtube i need to put yesterday's on youtube i didn't try the liquid lipstick but i imagine that it's fantastic and i know it's super affordable and then the liner okay because it's dual ended one's felt and then the other side is a brush tip it's a fantastic collection it was just so good now for blush, I have not stopped reaching for these. And again, I thought I'm like down here in the bushes. Leave me alone. <laughs> My shoulder still hurts a little bit. So I'm trying to like adjust. I'm better though. But for blushes, I have been reaching for these. The P. Louise liquid blushes. I totally thought that they were a TikTok gimmick. The formula has impressed me. I am impressed. I, I will say I'm not easily impressed there are a lot of very viral things that you see that i don't enjoy um but these are fantastic and i feel like they add coverage without being heavy so you'll never have gaps Do you know how sometimes there's a gap between our concealer to our blush to our bronzer it just fills in gaps and it's stunning my favorite shade is probably going to be this one lychee lady 
that's my favorite shade. I also love the liquid bronzer equally. Again, it just fills in gaps. I don't have it on right now. I just threw on a quick little powder bronzer. Um, but if I'm doing, it, I feel like it translates well to kind of everyday makeup too, but with full glam, because it does add that coverage, it is just spectacular and it works perfectly with just about any foundation type as well. Powder foundation, you'd have to put it on top. Um, but I've tried it with multiple foundations and I just enjoy this and the liquid blush so much. So my shade in this is Gingerbread Glaze, yeah. So another thing that really wowed me this week were these loose shadows here from J.Cat Beauty. There's multiple shades. I really wanna use all of them. I don't know what my mommy is walking about. She's down there. I'm supposed to be down there helping her cook, but I'm up here. I snuck away. I'm gonna be in so much trouble, straight to jail. So these, this is the one that I used. What shade is this? This is called Vanity Goddess Chromatic Pigment. Um, we'll just call them loose pigments. They'll be easy to find. This is fourth dimension. This is the one that I used on Monday. These are fantastic for the price. And these are awesome too. These are their Chrome Eye Mousse. These have a bouncy texture to them. Look at this. Stunning. They feel, look at that, still so much pigment. Wow. We found some good stuff here with the J-Cat Beauty. Let's open this together. I ordered this myself. Jingle, 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 jingle. This is the Pat McGrath, that new blue eyeshadow. I think I got the, yeah, I got the eye gel too. I don't know. I just had to have it. Had to have it. So this is an eye gloss. This is a sequin that's going everywhere. Let's swatch this really quickly. I saw some of that other blue on my hand. I love an eye gloss. I'm gonna be the bearer of bad news here. An eye gloss is going to move. It's going to move around. It's gonna do things. This one has a little bit of blue shimmer in it. Um, this is something that's just for fun. This is not gonna last you all night. This will be uncomfortable. I'm not gonna to lie to you. This is just for funsies. This is being creative and wanting to take a picture of it, but, but it's gonna make your eyes shimmer, glimmer. It's gonna amplify. It's, it's going to look gorgeous, but it's only going to look gorgeous for 30 minutes. And I just don't want you to put this on, go to a holiday party and wind up with eye gloss dripping down through here, down to your chin. That being said, this is, this spoke to me. This actually, this just screamed at me. Okay, this just said, I need to come live with you. And I said, come to my house. I just think it's so beautiful. And then this with the black base is going to be next level. I'm excited for it, very excited. So I'm just gonna leave that right here and I'm going to fight with these little sequins for a little while. They're, they're, they're all my vanity. So I think that that is everything, this eyebrow's eyebrow. I think that's everything. Yeah, I try not to just talk about everything. I really wanna talk about things that really impressed me, things that inspired me. I don't wanna just be like, oh, here we are, the next thing. Okay, now next thing, because now I, I just, I know, I know that we just, we don't need all of it, but I do, because you you never know, there might be somebody in the market to, to add something to their collection. Um, so that's why we do this. You watching this, you might not want this, but then you watching this, you might be like, hey, it is time for a new eyeshadow. So that's why I think these are really, really, really fun, but I never want you to feel like you need all of this. You probably have something similar in your collection already, but if not, that's why these roundups are fun. All right, I love y'all so much. Um, my family is actually about to be here from out of town. I'm very excited. We're gonna have so much fun. I'm gonna go downstairs now with my mama and we're gonna finish cooking and I think we're putting up the tree. It's very wonderful. And I know, I wanna mention this again, I know the holidays, they are not always a happy holiday for everyone. So if you, feel lonely and you just want to chat I, I i'm here i'm here i know it's a lonely time and i won't i won't be on my phone i won't be on social media tomorrow but i'm always checking my dms and i'm always chatting with y'all so um if if you just need someone just to say hi and just a quick chat i'm here i love you so much 
and I'll still see y'all tonight in whatever I post. Okay. <laughs>